my friend Sonia and Halloween is almost here so we decided to do something super spooky. <laughs> we are going to make tiny hats for our kittens to wear as their Halloween costume. We just went to the store. We went a little wild. But we went a little crazy at the store. Options. Well first of all, this is how I know I'm old because I'm buying like Halloween props <laughs> with glitter on spooky them. House. Halloween props. We got all these silly things. So we have all this paper. Oh my god, this one is my favorite. You can guess who that's gonna be for. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't want to do like full Halloween costumes because I think they'd be pretty miserable. In yeah. We feel like a hat. We can handle a hat. We got some spooky stuff. We got some spiders. We got, got crazy googly eyes. You love the googly I eyes. I like the eyes. I'm gonna make something fun with that. <laughs> we got little pumpkins. This is gonna be for a princess hat, and we're gonna make a very special sports hat <laughs> costume. Sports hat, oh my god. We're gonna make a baseball hat for Balboa. <laughs> oh no, it's real. Balboa is totally like a... Athletic. He's a jock. We're going to do a princess hat for Topanga. Topanga is a very prim and proper pretty girl. So for Halloween, she's going to be a princess in a precious pink hat. Do we know what the heck we're doing? Topanga is going to have a toilet paper veil on her princess crown. So the princess hat is basically like just a cone. Whoa! Okay, so if you are at home and you have a glue gun, be very careful with it. It can burn you. Do under adult supervision. Ooh, time is of the essence. Never force a kitten to wear a hat if they don't want to wear a hat. True. Definitely never force your cat to wear a costume. I see a lot of people who put their cats in costumes and I feel like if your cat is willing to wear clothing, that's one thing. If they have a medical reason for needing to wear clothing, that's one thing, but most cats just prefer to be nudists. Yeah. <laughs> cats are nudists in hats. So I think this little, so this is washi tape. Washi tape is like colorful, pretty tape that you can use um, on your fancy hats to do uh, like lining, princess flowers. <laughs> so I put like a little, thing around it so I can put my princess flowers. Oh my god, she's gonna love it. It's so cute! Oh my god. Yeah! <laughs> I want one! And then I'm just gonna put like a little something on yeah. top. Should I put a flower or should I put a... Oh, it should be a poop wall. wall. We, want, we don't want her to be it. silly. Yeah. We want her to be a refined toilet paper princess. Yeah. Okay, so Topanga's princess hat is done. Let's show it to her. Yay. She's a beauty queen. Good job, Sparkle Princess. Good job, girlfriend. Yay! Okay, what should I do next? Um, should I do a pizza? Jumbo Slice and Deep Dish are best friends, so they're going to get a themed costume. Jumbo Slice's Halloween costume is going to be a pizza delivery boy, complete with a pizza box and a jumbo slice of pizza. What if it's like a pizza box with a slice of pizza in it? Now it's a pizza box. Oh, it's perfect. It's so cute. Pizza delivery. I want to put a slice of pizza in it. So I'm gonna make a triangle because pizza is a freaking triangle. None of this rectangular pizza nonsense. Mm -hmm. It's a jumbo slice in a box. Yeah. Oh my God. Okay, so maybe it is jumbo slice. 31 years old, using a glue stick. <laughs> Special delivery. <laughs> my pizza box. <laughs> it actually looks like a pizza box now though, yeah. kind of. No, it's, it's there, I love it. So this is a jumbo slice. <laughs> for jumbo slice. Very literal Halloween costume. For Halloween, jumbo slice is being a jumbo slice. <laughs> Mr. Jumbo Slice and his jumbo slice. You're a jumbo slice for real. <laughs> He's mesmerized. Ooh. Looking good. Oh my god, Deep Dish is a chef. He would love to be a chef, because he's such a mess. Yeah. Oh, hello, Eloise. Ooh, Ooh, don't touch the hot glue. That looks like a chef hat. Okay. 
You're just gonna like glue pizzas all over it kind yeah. of thing? Yeah. They're gonna be to help you cut some yeah. out. Teamwork on this Teamwork! Part. Makes the dream work! Yeah. And the dream is kittens in pizza hats. So I accidentally ordered like 10,000 <laughs> cotton balls and we don't need 10,000 cotton balls, but maybe we do need 10,000 cotton balls We're to gonna, make yeah. colonial wigs. Will Rogers is a classic orange tabby and an all-American boy. We're going to give him a George Washington hat and wig for Halloween. So I'm now, <laughs> I've sculpted <laughs> this tiny wig out of cotton balls. <laughs> You are killing me. And now I'm gonna make a little scrunchie for the ponytail. Oh my god, Will wears a scrunchie just like I do. Yeah. <laughs> That's amazing. So I have the base front and the back and then the bottom. Are you gonna put something on the front of it? Like yeah, a make it a little gold star. Oh, that's cute. And my next step is just to attach it here and then we have a George Washington. So this yeah. on top of here. <laughs> Perfect. Good job, Will. I like your ponytail. Okay. His sparkling <laughs> <So> star. <laughs> you make a great George Washington. <laughs> <laughs> he looks great. That's the best Halloween costume I've seen in a long time. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Oh. Well, why don't we each do a monster hat? Okay. Which one do you want to do? I will start with the spidery witch okay. kind of one. Spider witch? Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna make yeah. like a cyclops with arms. Yeah. Okay. So green? Maybe Zuma needs a purple monster hat. One-eyed purple people eater. Zuma is a wild child who pretends to be tough, but is actually a total sweetheart. We're going to make her a really silly monster hat that's equal parts friendly and fierce. They have claws, right? Oh yeah, I guess I should just do like a claw guy. That's scary. He needs like a mouth too, like a... And yeah. no, I didn't think this through. Yeah, like... Oh, I love it. It's a little bit... <laughs> oh my god, it's so good. It's a little lopsided. But like, what monster is symmetrical, honestly? True. Let me see these eyes. Yeah. Ooh. These eyes are crazy. Yeah. Happy. <laughs> so should I do some teeth? Yeah. Like tiny little fangs. Oh, so cute. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. I love it so much. <laughs> crazy monster. Just cut your rectangle, make it into a tube. You're basically making a little cylinder. Don't burn yourself. So you can make them as tall or as short or wide or skinny as you want. So all you need to do to make the top of your hat is to find a piece of paper that is um, at least as big as your circle and add a generous amount of glue to the inside rim of the top of your hat and stick it on there. So while that's drying, I'm going to do my washi tape and this is going to go around the brim of the hat. So that's the top of the hat, then you just cut away the top of your hat. So there is most of my hat. Now I'm gonna make the brim of the hat. So basically, same idea as making the top, you just add glue to the inside. And so now that is gonna be glued to this and then you just cut out the brim of your hat. And that's how you make a top hat. So there's my top hat, adorable. Okay, so then this top hat is going to have a topping, which is bats. There's my fancy top hat. That is a ridiculous hat. Super spooky! This is really heavy though. Oh. Oh my god. <laughs> I gotta stop.
stop trying to put the kitten hats on. I'm just jealous because I want one. Yours are very involved and mine are very, I don't want to glue toilet paper to a cone. <laughs> Yay! All right, I finally finished it. It's so cute. She's gonna love it. Catalina is a bewitching beauty queen who enchants every person she meets. For Halloween, she's going to get a spooky witch hat with spider webs. Catalina witch hat. Looking good. So spooky. Spooktacular. Good job, Catalina. Catalina. The baseball hat. Mm -hmm. Okay, that one I need to look in the book. Balboa is a total athlete and he's always playing around. This Halloween, he's going to dress up as a professional baseball player. Oh, I've done a baseball hat before. Here I am acting like I've never made a baseball hat for a kitten. I totally made one for Badger. Oh. For cat camp. So I'm gonna try to finish this little baseball hat here. Not my best work. Okay. It's acceptable. Have to be the best. I just have to try. Okay, so now I have to make my baseball hat. What's this called? The, the build, build hat. Okay. I'm like, there you go. Wow, a couple freaking geniuses over here. Okay. <laughs> yeah, it looks like a baseball hat. Now. It's really good. It all comes together. Yay! He's like, wait a minute. Is there something on my head? <laughs> Wow, we have so many leftovers. We can make like six million hats for six million kittens. I wonder if YouTube would like to see a seasonal hat making party. Yeah. Let us know in the comments if you want to see seasonal hats. Yeah. We could do Christmas hats. Oh yeah, little elf hats. Elf hats. <laughs> the shift.